Yeah, starting off the video journey, I'm real excited. Um, you know, it's the road to UFC 175. You know, I'm gonna leave everything in the cage. I'm gonna do my best just like I do every single camp. I'm gonna train hard and I'm gonna try to put on a great performance for you guys. I can promise you guys one thing, I will show up to the fight and leave it all in the cage, just like every, every time I do. Uh, today's workout, um, he had mentioned beforehand, do you have a set thing what you want to work on with him, or is it let me feel where he's at today? A little bit of both, okay. you know, because he might have done something at the gym where he got hurt, or, you know, we need to focus on this area a little bit more. Uh, so it's kind of a, a give and take. Uh, for the most part, I have a plan, and then we'll deviate uh, from that or stick right to it, depending on how he's feeling. Um, so Tuesday, we did a bunch of legs and core. So today we did a lot of upper body and core. So the majority of these these are like a total body, making sure we get the core, the explosiveness. And so we're doing we're preparing for everything. You know, yeah, he might want to stand up with this guy a little bit more, but I'm still gonna have him moving a lot more, you know, so no, I want him to stay healthy. He's always in pretty decent shape. Um we already lifted Yeah, we were already lifted even before this all the fight he accepted the fight right. um i want to make sure first and foremost he stays healthy so that that means don't get in that hey i have to speed it up thing so um as much um intense uh focus work for the fight fight specific type stuff um but again staying healthy that's that's the main key and the basis was there so we just kind of pick up from there and again, yes, train hard, but train smart at the same time, too, you know, because he's going to do a lot, too. He knows it's short notice, so he's already, I got to do a lot of stuff to get ready for it. And I, I feel sometimes my job is to kick it back a little bit, slow down. We still have, we still have time, you know. And his biggest thing is his cardio. And once he feels he has his cardio, then he's feeling really good. The strength is, uh, the strength, the strength is a, is a maintenance thing, you know. We hit it really hard once there's a fight, but we always maintain that certain level of strength. You've trained him for other fights in the past. Mm -hmm. At this point, would you say he's where he should be this far out from the fight? Definitely. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm excited. You know, we've been talking about his cardio. He said that cardio is there. Strength is there. I mean, um, it's one thing with him fighting 135 too. Like, I'm so confident in his strength. So that's there. Um, his cardio is there. He's ready to go. He feels healthy, you know. I'm excited. Trevor's just seem to get cranky sometimes. Like me and Trevor, we get at it sometimes because you know we're best friends. Too. Yeah. We're not. We're not only. He doesn't only train me, but we're best friends. So that's where you know we can argue and get away with it, man. But you know we get through it. You know we get through our disagreements and everything. And, and just um, I mean, it turned out to be an excellent workout once you know. Once you got through that, and then I was like, shit, man, I shouldn't have said anything because it just made it a lot harder. Yeah, and you know what else is nice is that um, we, like, since us being such good friends, we have really good communication. So, um, if I get hurt at the gym, we work, we did something else. We, we implemented the, you know, the, um, the planks and the, and the, um, the um, mountain climbers instead. So, I mean, we, we have a good communication. He knows when I'm tired, when I need rest. Rest is more important than people um, really think it is. Um, right now we're two and a half weeks out. Feel pretty good, feel confident. Short notice fight, so I had to kind of force myself into shape. I've been lifting, so I, I feel I, you know, I feel like I've been strong, but um, I feel like my cardio is finally there, and that's the most important thing to me, is, um, is having the cardio in the fight, being able to push my opponent, and not gassing out in the fight, being able to stay sharp. So I feel like I feel like it's good. And uh, my weight cut is this is the easiest weight cut I've ever had, even on short notice. I mean, my weight. I'm so far ahead of my weight cut. I'm very surprised at even myself. Yep. And I'm <laughs> going back to Vegas, and I love to fight in Vegas. That was one of the big reasons that I really accepted this fight. You know, on such short notice too, is because I knew it was going to be in Vegas. I knew such a big opportunity. And I love fighting in Vegas. You know, my friends, my family get to come out and, and watch me fight. And you know, that's my home away from home. 